scientists just created the largest digital twin of the universe ever. It contains 3.4 billion galaxies, and they made it with a Swiss supercomputer. But that's not all. This simulation is just a tiny slice of the real universe, about 1 39th of the area that the James Webb Space Telescope can observe. The reason for this is pretty mind-blowing. This digital twin was made to test the results from the Euclid Space Mission, which launched last year on a mission to map the universe to study dark matter and dark energy. To do this, it will measure how much gravitational lensing occurs in space. If you don't know what gravitational lensing is, it's basically when massive objects warp the space around them so much that they distort the light coming from objects behind them. This distortion reveals the invisible mass of the object doing the warping, allowing us to see things like black holes and dark matter. Now, Euclid can observe 10 billion years into the past. That means when it looks at a galaxy 10 billion light years away, it's seeing it as it was 10 billion years ago. This time travel capability is what will allow scientists to test our current theories about dark energy. Because dark energy is thought to be the force causing the accelerated expansion of the universe, by observing how the universe has changed over such a vast amount of a time, we can learn more about this mysterious force. This digital twin of the universe will help scientists calibrate the instruments on Euclid and prepare for the 2026 release of its data. At that point, we should have enough information to either confirm our current understanding of cosmology or be forced to completely change it. So, what do you think? Are we on the verge of a new discovery about the universe? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. If you liked this video, make sure to check out my others for more updates on everything aerospace industry and interstellar exploration related. With that, I'll see you next time.